Hello everyone, and welcome to our video on DevOps. In the rapidly evolving landscape of software development, the term DevOps has gained significant prominence. DevOps, a portmanteau of development and operations, is not just a set of practices, but a cultural and organizational philosophy aimed at fostering collaboration, enhancing communication, and streamlining the software development and delivery process. In this video, we'll explore the essence of DevOps, its core principles, key practices, and the transformative impact it has on the world of technology. The DevOps movement started to coalesce sometime between 2007 and 2008, when IT operations and software development communities raised concerns what they felt was a fatal level of dysfunction in the industry. They railed against the traditional software development model, which called for those who write code to be organizationally and functionally apart from those who deploy and support that code. What began in online forums and local meetups is now a major theme in the software zeitgeist, which is probably what brought you here. You and your team are feeling the pain caused by siloed teams and broken lines of communication within your company. What is DevOps? To kick things off, let's answer the fundamental question. What is DevOps? DevOps emerges as a response to the historical divide between development and operations teams. Beyond being a set of practices, it stands as a cultural and organizational philosophy that seeks to break down silos, encourage collaboration, and streamline the software development and delivery process. Under a DevOps model, development and operations teams are no longer siloed. Sometimes these two teams are merged into a single team where the engineers work across the entire application lifecycle from development and test to deployment to operations and develop a range of skills not limited to a single function. In some DevOP models, quality assurance and security teams may also become more tightly integrated with development and operations and throughout the application lifecycle. When security is the focus of everyone on a DevOps team, this is sometimes referred to as DevSecOps, these teams use practices to automate processes that historically have been manual and slow. They use a technology stack and tooling which help them operate and evolve applications quickly and reliably. These tools also help engineers independently accomplish tasks, for example deploying code or provisioning infrastructure, that normally would have required help from other teams and this further increases a team's velocity. The three pillars of DevOps. DevOps rests on three foundational pillars, collaboration, automation and feedback. Collaboration underscores cross-functional teamwork, Teams make decisions and focus on delivering value to customers in a DevOps culture. This culture fosters a sense of shared ownership and supports experimentation and innovation. Automation streamlines processes through tools. This is the term used to describe the automation of various software development, testing, deployment and infrastructure management processes using tools and procedures. Teams can minimize errors, improve consistency and increase productivity by automating these processes. And finally, feedback promotes continuous learning and improvement throughout the development lifecycle. Teams can identify areas for improvement and make data-driven decisions by monitoring key performance indicators, KPIs. This makes it easier to ensure that everyone is working towards the same goals and things move forward. Key DevOps practices. DevOps is not just a buzzword, it's a set of concrete practices. At the heart of DevOps lie key practices that define its methodology. Continuous integration, CI, involves regularly integrating code changes into a shared repository, ensuring early detection and resolution of issues. Developers practicing continuous integration merge their changes back to the main branch as often as possible. The developers' changes are validated by creating a build and running automated tests against the build. By doing so, you avoid integration challenges that can happen when waiting for release day to merge changes into the release branch. Continuous deployment CD automates the release process for swift and reliable delivery, while infrastructure as code IAC ensures consistent and reproducible infrastructure configurations. In theory, with continuous delivery, you can decide to release daily, weekly, fortnightly, or whatever suits your business requirements. However, if you truly want to get the benefits of continuous delivery, you should deploy to production as early as possible to make sure that you release small batches that are easy to troubleshoot in case of a problem. The DevOps model relies on effective tooling to help teams rapidly and reliably deploy and innovate for their customers. These tools automate manual tasks, help teams manage complex environments at scale, and keep engineers in control of the high velocity that is enabled by DevOps. AWS provides services that are designed for DevOps and that are built first for use with the AWS cloud. DevOps culture. 
DevOps transcends tools and practices, manifesting as a cultural shift within organizations. It champions open communication, collaboration, and a mindset of continuous improvement. DevOps empowers teams to take ownership of the entire software delivery process, instilling a sense of shared responsibility for project success. Software and the internet have transformed the world and its industries from shopping to entertainment to banking. Software no longer merely supports a business, rather it becomes an integral component of every part of a business. Companies interact with their customers through software delivered as online services or applications and on all sorts of devices. Benefits of DevOps. The adoption of DevOps yields an array of benefits. 1. Speed. Move at high velocity so you can innovate for customers faster. Adapt to changing markets better and grow more efficient at driving business results. The DevOps model enables your developers and operations teams to achieve these results. For example, microservices and continuous delivery let teams take ownership of services and then release updates to them quicker. 2. Rapid delivery. Increase the frequency and pace of releases so you can innovate and improve your product faster. The quicker you can release new features and fix bugs, the faster you can respond to your customers' needs and build competitive advantage. Continuous integration and continuous delivery are practices that automate the software release process, from build to deploy. Reliability. DevOps ensures the quality of application updates and infrastructure changes so you can reliably deliver at a more rapid pace while maintaining a positive experience for end users. Use practices like continuous integration and continuous delivery to test that each change is functional and safe. Monitoring and logging practices help you stay informed of performance in real time. 4. Scale. Automation and consistency help you manage complex or changing systems efficiently and with reduced risk. For example, infrastructure as code helps you manage your development, testing and production environments in a repeatable and more efficient manner. 5. Improved collaboration. Developers and operations teams collaborate closely, share many responsibilities and combine their workflows. This reduces inefficiencies and saves time, e.g. reduced handover periods between developers and operations, writing code that takes into account the environment in which it is run. 6. Security. You can adopt a DevOps model without sacrificing security by using automated compliance policies, fine-grained controls and configuration management techniques, for example, using infrastructure as code and policy as code, you can define and then track compliance at scale. Challenges and solutions. Despite the undeniable benefits, the adoption of DevOps is not without challenges. Resistance to change, integration issues, and cultural barriers may impede progress. Proactive strategies, effective communication, and a commitment to continuous improvement are vital in overcoming these obstacles. Real-world DevOps implementation. Real-world examples of successful DevOps implementations provide valuable insights. Companies that have fully embraced DevOps have not only witnessed improvements in delivery speed and efficiency, but have also undergone cultural transformations that positively impact team dynamics and overall morale. Future trends in DevOps. As technology advances, DevOps evolves. Emerging trends such as DevSecOps, integrating security into the DevOps process, AIOps, leveraging artificial intelligence for IT operations, and the incorporation of machine learning and automation are shaping the future landscape of DevOps. Software and the internet have transformed the world and its industries from shopping to entertainment to banking. Software no longer merely supports a business, rather it becomes an integral component of every part of a business. Companies interact with their customers through software delivered as online services or applications and on all sorts of devices. They also use software to increase operational efficiencies by transforming every part of the value chain, such as logistics, communications and operations, in a similar way that physical goods companies transformed how they design, build and deliver products using industrial automation throughout the 20th century. Companies in today's world must transform how they build and deliver software. And there you have it, a comprehensive guide to DevOps from its definition to its practical applications, tools, culture and future trends. Organizations and teams continue to adopt DevOps practices and tools. In a survey of 500 DevOps practitioners, Alassian found that 50% of organizations say they've been practicing DevOps for more than three years. Unfortunately, despite agreement on the definition of DevOps and the benefits of implementing DevOps practices, organizations and teams still struggle to fulfill the promise of DevOps. 
teams must focus on continuous feedback, iteration and improvement to deploy better and faster to meet customers' needs. Transitioning to DevOps requires a change in culture and mindset. At its simplest, DevOps is about removing the barriers between two traditionally siloed teams, development and operations. In some organizations, there may not even be separate development and operations teams. Engineers may do both. I hope you found this information valuable. If you did, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. We'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you for joining us on this in-depth exploration of DevOps. Until next time, happy coding.